What is going on everybody? This is Game Overies. And today I wanted to go ahead and talk about whether or not it is worth your time and effort to join the Sparrow Racing League and try to rank up and get those loot drops. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you this. I have just hit rank 4 in the SRL. So I haven't played any games yet actually as a rank 4 participant. So these are all the rewards I have received as a rank 3. As you can see I've gotten a ton of helmets right there. 319s, 318, 316, you name it. At level 3, they start dropping at 310 and above. So it's pretty sweet. So these are all the other helmets that I got. They're all in my Postmaster because I didn't have any room. So yeah, um, quite a few helmets, if I don't say so myself. And out of all the races I've done today, I have only managed to get one 320 helmet. So to me, I think it's worth doing the SRL events, trying to get up to at least rank 3 just to get these helmet and uh, class item drops because I don't have any 320 helmets or 320 class items. So for me, it was definitely worth it. And I think anybody else who is in the same boat, I would say it's worth it for you because you're going to get a ton of drops. The races only last for five minutes tops. You know, you're, you're going to get rewards. I mean, I've, I would say it's totally worth it. So let me go ahead and show you my SRL record book, basically where I'm at and how long it took me to get all this stuff. I have a total of 90 races on the Mars map. I've won a total of 25. And things like, you know, I've landed 419 tricks. I have almost, I've hit almost 6,000 gates on this map alone. So it's pretty ridiculous. Like I said, I've been grinding the hell out of this. Just been doing this rather than anything else in Destiny. And I've been doing it pretty much all day. And let's see, 91 races on Venus, the 658 tricks landed. And I've won 31 races on that map. So about the same amount of gates, about 6,000 gates hit. But if you do the math, I mean, that's about, what is that, 180 or so races that I've done. And let's say four and a half, five minutes each. I mean, there's a lot of time that I've been putting into this. And really, I've only gotten one 320 helmet. So here are the shaders I've received. I got all the shaders that this has to offer and I decided to go ahead and put on my Trials of Osiris gear just to show you what it looks like with some normal gear. So I'm just going to go ahead and let you guys look at these and absorb what they have to offer, whether or not you like them, whether or not you think it's worth it. If you're all about shaders, you know, you care about how your character looks, I would definitely participate in this event because as you can see, there are a ton of shaders that you can get. There is a total of what? Yeah, eight shaders. Eight eight shaders total <laughs> yeah eight shaders that's awesome that is crazy they, they just drop like crazy so you'll definitely get them all if you put it if you put as much time into it as i have you will get all of them i can i can guarantee you that anyways that's pretty much it let me know what your thoughts are on the sparrow racing league and whether or not you think it's worth it for your time and effort to try and get this gear i would say definitely it was for me so so in conclusion everybody the best part about this is the fact that I can get some close to 320 helmets and class items and infuse them into other helmets and class items. Whether it be my Warlock, Hunter, or Titan, I can go ahead and get that gear up to almost 320, if not 320, depending on how much I play in the Sparrow Racing League. I appreciate you guys watching this video. Please leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe to my channel for more Destiny content along with other video games. So on that note, guys, thanks again and ovaries out.